time I tried my luck with some plant-based jerky, it didn't end so well. Ugh. You see, if any food personifies the pinnacle of masculinity, it's jerky. Maybe because it's a no-spoil snack for campers, hikers, and explorers, and a version of it fed our troops from the Revolutionary War through the beginning of World War I. Of course, that version of salted meat was usually a bluish, stinky mess with hair and other animal remnants. And like their army biscuit, it was so hard and salty that it had to be soaked in water. So if classical manhood is a direct correlation with hardship, that made the troops of the American Revolution and Civil War some of the manliest men in history. And compared to them, today's slate of XY with their Jack Link's jerky and monster energy drinks are some of the most pampered men in history. So that's my long-winded way of saying I approve of plant-based jerky. In theory. Because the idea of normal jerky as a proxy for manhood is kind of silly anyway. So today's contender is normal plant-based jerky from, uh, oh, I'm sorry, ultimate plant-based jerky from vegan food provider Gardein. Eh, it passes the smell test, which shouldn't really be a concern, and it's definitely not as foul as the Korean barbecue plant-based jerky, but that's a low bar. And it's still not really fooling anyone. Look. They've made a ton of strides in the meat substitute business over the last decade or so, and this doesn't taste like a uh, newspaper, and it doesn't make me want to retch, but that's about the best I can say about it. Instead of meat, it tastes far more like what it actually is, peas, soy, and assorted other vegan items. And as such, it's got this nasty, gritty consistency to it that won't fool anyone used to actual beef, pork, or poultry. I've asked this before, but What's the point of faux products like this? Is it to wean people off meat? Because if this is the main alternative, I don't think going vegan would appeal to many people. If you want to go vegan, why choose a phony half measure like this over something that actually tastes good like baby carrots or a piece of fruit or anything with peanut butter? And if you're shooting for peas, I'd take pea soup all day over this nastiness. So I give Gardein Ultimate Plant-Based Jerky a completely useless two spoons out of five because it didn't make me vomit or compel me to immediately spit it out. Low bar. As always, be sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next time.